Ladies and gentlemen, you may know me mostly as healer, but I actually play Enhancement Shaman a lot. Recently, I started picking up my game as Enhance, and in the process, I found out and created a few weak auras that I think are going to be very useful for the spec, and next, I'm going to share them with you in this video. The first one is created by yours truly and it's going to show you an icon to remind you to cast Elemental Blast once you have 8 or more stacks of Maelstrom and you have the Pharaoh Spirits buff active. These are of course the windows when we actually want to press that button because the Pharaoh Spirits buff its damage significantly. And the best part is that the icon actually turns into a Lightning Bolt icon if you have 8 or more stacks of Maelstrom but you do not have Pharaoh Spirits active. The link to this week aura and everything else that I'm going to show you in this video can be found in the description below. Next up of course are a couple of week auras for the Pharaoh Spirits themselves and the first one is a simple icon reminder. It will show up every time your Pharaoh Spirits are actually available pretty similar to the Elemental Blast one but without any additional conditions. And then there's a follow up week aura that pops up once you activate the Pharaoh Spirit it shows you how much time you have until they expire and it even shows you what kind of feral wolves you actually have available. And while this last one might not be as useful as the previous one, I highly recommend to at least get the icon reminder as you want to basically cast the feral spirits as soon as they are available most of the time. Next on the menu is yet another icon which pops up when you have the hot hands buff active and it also has a timer showing you how much time you have remaining before the buff expires. Now the original week aura actually had an additional icon which would show how buffed your next level ash is going to be based on the flame shock ticks, but for some reason that didn't work for me so I created a fork that only has the hot hand portion of it. As I have the lava lash counter elsewhere on my UI, but I'm going to link both week auras in the description below so feel free to pick whichever one suits you better. Next up is another week aura created by myself and this one is going to show you a crash lightning icon once you're surrounded by two or more enemies and you don't have the crash lightning buff active. And big note here as this week aura is actually work in progress, first because we're not sure whether or not we want to show the icon when we have two enemies or more enemies around us, that number is subject to change and more importantly this week aura updates on every frame. This is actually quite computationally expensive so take caution if you decide to use this week aura and also join the discord in the description of this video to provide some feedback if you end up using it and you have some remarks to be made. Alright the last two week auras are basically a bonus, the first one if you noticed I have the primordial wave attached to my mouse cursor, it shows up on it every time that spell is off of cooldown. This is actually a weak aura that I use for my healing spells as well and I have it linked in the description of this video along with another video which explains how you can change the spells on the mouse cursor so you can modify it to your liking. You can even add additional spells there, show their stacks, cooldowns etc. So if you like the idea of having reminders on your mouse cursor definitely check this out. And last but not least, I'm sure you have something similar to that, but if you're running Wind Fury for a raid spec, because usually you don't do that in M+, this week aura is going to put a huge message in the middle of the screen, telling you that your Wind Fury is missing if you're not in range of it or you haven't casted it yet. So those are my Enhancement Shaman favorite week auras, do let me know in the comments below if you're going to use them or if you have something better in place. I'll see you guys in the next video, now get out of here.